So today I'm going to be comparing two lenses. The first lens I'm going to be testing is the 50mm 1.8G and I'm going to be testing it on my D5100 body. The second one is the 35mm 1.8G. This is at 1.8 aperture on the 50mm 1.8G. So I'm testing out to see what the lenses will look like when I'm interviewing people. Okay, this is the camera at the same distance and me sitting in the same place, but using the 35mm lens. My face is completely in the frame instead of it being like this before on the 50mm. So, this is me sitting comfortably. Same exact distance as the 50mm. Uh, I'm just checking to see if the detail and definition are the same. I normally wouldn't be auto-focusing during an interview because that would look terrible. Now I'm going to do a low light test after this. So, check it out. Okay, this is still the 35mm 1.8 and this is a low light test. I've got no light on in the room except for two computer monitors over on the side and um, it's got a harsh feel to it. It's got like a harsh light, like dramatic. That kind of feel to it. I'm doing all this on 200 ISO, 1.8 aperture, wide open, which is why I'm getting such good low light performance. Okay, I'm sitting in the same place. This is the 50 millimeter. I'm having a really hard time doing autofocus, so I'm going to do manual focus. It's also at 1.8. I'm looking again for detailed low light performance with the crop factor. It's more like an 80 millimeter instead of a 50, whereas the 35 would be more like a true 50 millimeter. Focusing is much faster on the 35. I have to give it credit for that. Focusing is much faster. Okay, so after reviewing all the clips, in my opinion, the winner is the 35mm 1.8G. Um, it looks clear to me. The low light looked a little bit better. I like that I'm not as zoomed in and gives me a little more versatility. And the clarity for doing interviews is still there.